if I'm if I'm easy work, I heard him say I'm easy work. If I was easy work, would you know you would take all that money that 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 he's offering you, but yet and still he want two hundred million for for Benavidez, and he want a hundred and fifty million to fight me. So that just lets me know right there that I'm a threat to him. I'm a threat to him. I'm a threat to his legacy. If I'm if I'm easy work, I heard him say. I'm easy work. If I was easy work, would well, you know you would take all that money that 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 he's offering you, but yet and still he want two hundred million for for Benavidez, and he want a hundred and fifty million to fight me. So that just lets me know right there that I'm a threat to him. That was Terrence Bud Crawford, man. He was responding to Canelo Alvarez saying. You know, on Sway's universe, like your easy work, uh, Crawford is easy work. Crawford is slowing down. You know, he was speaking all type of stuff, man. One minute Crawford didn't look good in the fight. One minute he moves around too much, but then yeah, he's slowing down, or he don't look the same. Uh, same thing he's saying about Benavidez now at one seventy five. Um, you know, the Canelo fans. Uh, they're happy about this. I've seen this stupid channel, man. I really hate. He like I forgot the name of the channel. He was going some some channel, man. They, he was pretty much going in on Bud. Like Bud is desperate for a Canelo fight. It was like I think that was in the title or something like that. Like, what are you talking about, man? It's it's not about being desperate. And then in this whole narrative about now that everybody's running with the Canelo, you know, since Canelo told Andre, you want a payday. Now that's something that everybody's running with. When somebody wants to fight Canelo and he don't want to fight him, they immediately go to that narrative that they just want to pay. They, I mean, wait a minute. Hold on. Nobody's denying that. Duh. This is boxing. They all want paydays, including Canelo, right? He's asking for paydays. He's asking for 150 million. He's asking for 200 million. He's get what? For how many How many uh, millions he get for each fight, man? Well, somewhere in the neighborhood of what? Uh, 30 million to fight 45 million something like that so i don't exactly know because i don't really follow the motherfuckers numbers like that but they all want paydays this is prize fighting so why are you mad at a boxer for wanting a good payday they all want paydays because these are prize fighters dude so canelo is is coming out with this whole thing about they want a payday what the fuck do you think they want man they gonna fight for free you ain't fighting for free you showing everybody you ain't you willing to take you want this that and the third amount to fight certain fighters so why is it that it's a problem with fighters want to come up and fight you for a payday the fuck do you think this is man and bud was he just came out and said what everybody else been saying if he's such an easy work and if benavidez is this easy why you need 200 million to fight benavidez why you need 150 to fight bud are you taking those amounts to fight Berlanga? Did you take that amount to fight John Ryder? Did you take that amount to fight anybody else? No, you didn't. You you didn't think twice about jumping in the ring with the rest of them dudes. Did you did you get that to fight Bevel? Did you get that to fight Kovalev? Which was a, to me a fixed fight in my opinion. So um, people look at it as Bud being desperate. You know, um, I don't see it like that. Like I said, it's a, it's it's legacy for Bud on top of a payday. Nobody's denying that um, that Terrence Crawford don't want a big bag. Why the fuck shouldn't he want a big bag? And nobody's denying Canelo's one of the cash draws right now in boxing. Nobody's denying that. We know all of that already. Don't keep stuffing that in our face. We don't get. Nobody cares about that shit. Stop using that as a deflective tactic. You know, yeah, use this shit with yo. I was thinking that. The, you know, Tank was worse. I think Canelo was worse, dude. Canelo, I think, is a hundred times worse than Javante Davis, bro. And even with the um the weight shit that he's putting on fighters like with Ryan Garcia and all that stuff and um other fighters, but nah, Canelo take the cake, man. That dude is the biggest fucking diva I've ever seen. He takes the cake, man. And people are looking at it as Bud being frustrated, like. What are you talking about, man? You know what I mean? Y'all, y'all keep running to that payday shit. Why is Canelo worried about a? Why are y'all and Canelo worrying about a payday? Turkey Alice Sheik was paying motherfuckers, so why do you care 
about a payday. He was coming out of his pocket. Canelo wasn't coming out of his pocket to pay nothing. It was it was Turkey that was going to do all of the paying. Right? Ah, understand now. I get it. But it is a threat. So has Benavidez. Hmm? And, and, and the funny thing is, man, uh, a lot of the Canelo super extremists, they up here like, well, Bud didn't look good at 154. He couldn't even knock out Madrimor. It ain't even about the fucking knockout. He can go up there and spark fucking Canelo. It don't even have nothing to do with knocking Canelo out, man. If that just so happened to have happened, oh well. But did uh, Canelo look good against Beevil? He got he he went in and got beat the fuck up. So what are you talking about, man? His power ain't even carried to 175. At least Bud still has good power at 154. He didn't even rattle Beevil, did he? I'm waiting. I'm waiting for the answer to that. I'll wait on that one. Did he rattle Beevil? Beevil? Hell no. And if you want to be honest about that fight, I think if Beevil would have pressed the gas, he could have stopped fucking Canelo. Go back and watch it. But anyway, shout out to Terrence Crawford, man. Fuck Canelo, man. You know, we don't we don't know we don't need that dude, bro. Oh, he needs you more than he, uh, Canelo needs uh, uh Bud needs Canelo more than Canelo need Bud. Canelo don't even need Bud. Yeah, Canelo don't need Bud because they're in different weight divisions. He has nothing to really offer um Bud at um uh he has nothing to really offer Canelo, to be honest. Uh yeah, Bud does need them belts. And that 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 undisputed status, that legacy, he don't really need it because he has. And, and just let's be real here, Bud don't really need Canelo either. Bud is okay. Bud is a millionaire already. Bud is already undisputed. He already accomplished more than Canelo. If you want to be technical, he already accomplished more than Canelo. Canelo was never two times undisputed, was he? So. What are you talking about? Can, Bud don't really need. He wants him. Let's be, let's let's get that right. He wants him. He doesn't need Canelo. Like just like Canelo don't need Bud right now, at all. Bud don't need Canelo. He just wants Canelo. Get that shit right, man. But anyway, what y'all think? This is Rebel Life Boxing. Catch y'all in the next one. And I'm off this. <laughs>